Well, it was my idea to get married at Starbucks, and it made absolute, total, complete sense to me. I would just like to know how many mothers have a daughter that rides in on a convertible in the dead of winter with a strapless wedding gown on to dance with their father in the parking lot of Starbucks. We fell in love over coffee. We usually would end the night at Starbucks. We close them down. And then go sit out in the parking lot for another five hours because we weren't done talking. Yeah. <laughs> somebody to put their whole life on hold for a year. I just didn't think it was fair. I knew the kind of struggles that were ahead. I thought I did. After Carmen left, um, my mom, knowing what a coffee hound I am, uh, and knowing that I needed somebody, I remember she contacted me and said, let's have some coffee. With this guy up and gone, things were just kicked out from underneath her. For a year, me and my mom um, shared everything at that store. Um, I shared my struggles, and my mom helped me remember the the day-to-day -day good things. The ceremony was awesome. She come around with a convertible dress blowing in the wind. You know, yeah, I remember it. going home that night and thinking, wow, you know, this is so magical. Amazing. And Amazing. we just got to share in such a very intimate piece of someone's life. You walked the journey with me. You went with me to all of the horrendous things, but you were there for the great stuff yes. too. Yes, It really is more about the journey than the destination and, and the people that are involved on the journey. And, well, yeah, sometimes you know, it doesn't matter where you go, it matters who's next to you yeah. while you're getting there. Yeah, yeah. it does count. Yeah. Huge.